Hello, 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 familia, what's happening? You're preparing all the lives. Yeah, I think we're going live. That's good. That is good. All right. Woo. So let me know when you tap in. Let me know when you are available. Where are you tapping in from? We want to hear from you. We are connecting in this vortex together, guys. Thank you all for being here. You should see how I'm putting everything together, working with three, three phones right now in order to do this face, this live in the Instagram and Facebook and in YouTube. Yes. So I'm um, really grateful, guys. Thank you for all your comments that we've had. Uh, from yesterday's first day uh, So good to see so many people just just loving it just waking up like feeling that community, right? It's so good to know that we are not alone and that we, we can use so social media to to connect right and to and to rise together That's the idea, right? So um, yeah guys if it's your Second day here, please write day two. Yes, if it's your first day, just write write number one. So I know it's your it's your uh, first day. You're doing this activation, okay? And then uh, if you want to watch the recording, we did a recording. It's up there. It's there um, forever. I'll keep it up there. So it's the continuation of this. But don't worry if you're just arriving today, you will rock it, okay? I promise you, you will have a blast. So stay with me. I will be sharing some mindset. I also will be sharing some activation, some movement. Today we're gonna go into alchemy, right? So alchemy is really all about transformation, transmutation. We're gonna talk about that, the capacity to transmute, to transform emotions, to transform energy, right? Stuck emotions that we have, like right now there's so many people in fear, so many people in doubt, so many people like not feeling good with themselves and uncertain of what's gonna happen uh, right now in life, right? We have no idea what's gonna happen. So, so it's so good to transform this because when you're living with these emotions, guys, these low vibration emotions, what happens is it's affecting you, it's affecting your field and you're almost giving your power away. So this, 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 these live streams that I'm doing are all to give you your power back so you don't depend if the government closes for another month and you don't know what to do when you're there, like you can't even go out of home. Like it doesn't matter, you learn to be in the present. That's all where you can be, right? So I have a question for you guys. Like when this crisis is gonna end, where are you going to be? Where are you going to be inside? Are you gonna use this crisis to like expand and open up to creativity, to your purpose, to other levels of your energy? Or are you just waiting, just hanging out, lost in social media, lost in Netflix, just waiting for time to pass by? That's my question for you guys, because it's so, it could be so normal to just like, whatever, let me just surrender to this and wait till the government lets me out. You know, what, are you kidding me? Guys, there's so much to do. There's so much to learn. There's so many books to read. There's so many like stuff on social media to learn and expand and do the inner work, right guys? That's why I'm doing this also because I wanna share all these tools with you. I don't want you to stay in your little cage in your little me and your limiting beliefs. That's not where you, where you can play. Only you can choose it. I don't know what you're doing behind the scenes, but I'm sending all my energy just like that. Just like that sun right there, right? That sun right there, right? That energy emanating from your core. When you wake up your energy, guys, you are unstoppable. You just want to serve. You just want to give. You just want to help others. It's inevitable. You don't do it because, oh, I want to have likes and I want to have hearts. And I mean, that, that's always good, right? <laughs> but you don't care. You don't care if they even recognize you. I do so many things anonymously because it's not about feeling the recognition from people. I love to see them smile. I love to see them laugh. I love to, to, to know that I changed somebody's life with my laughter, with my shiny eyes, with, with, with a hug, with a word, with, with a video, with, with silence. Just being present, just breathing. Just by me breathing and being in my energy, in my love, I tell others that that is the vibration we can play. 
Uh, it's, it's like when you teach children, you've seen, like you can tell your child, you can tell whatever you want. Don't do this, do that. But they're always going to do what you do. You can say whatever you want, right? But they're, they're, they're feeling you. They're feeling you, right? And they know underneath. So you're like really get angry when they're like doing something they're not supposed to do. But it's something that we as parents do. So it's like, okay, <laughs> I'm getting angry with him, but he's just reflecting me. Uh, the stuff I do that I don't like, that's not good. You know, I have that with my phone sometimes. I get lost a little bit in social media, answering too much, too many questions and stuff. And I have my son, Daniel, that's actually helping me here set up the stuff. We're gonna introduce him in a little bit. So, you know, sometimes he's like, hey dad, what's up? Why are you telling me to not get stuck in my phone? He works online, he does a lot of stuff online. So he's not even playing video games and all that stuff, but we get lost too much into the screen. So we have, a, 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 we have a made a negotiation that every hour, every hour and a half, we go, we ground, we release, we move, we breathe, we move the energy, we don't get stuck with the EMF, right guys? Because the Wi-Fi, the Bluetooth, can really affect you, right? It can really affect you. Your brain waves are affected by that. It distorts the brain waves. And you have a, if you have a distortion of brain waves, guys, just so you know, what happens is that you have mixed messages going into your brain and that's, that's craziness, right? It's like, it's like listening to 20 different drums at different rhythms. It's gonna be a mess, right? But if you get all drums together, there you go, there you go, yes! Come, Danny, say hello, say hello. Come, come, come. He's dressed uh, very peculiarly. He loves dressing with his, with his hat and like, yeah, this is Danny, this is my son. Hey Welcome guys. to the Facebook Live. <laughs> you want to tell something these guys about amplifying their energy? Um, We're doing alchemy today, huh? We're doing like, I'm explaining the whole thing of how to let go of all patterns and oh. procrastination and self-sabotage and all that stuff. Distraction, all that stuff that kills us, right? Yeah. Um, well... <laughs> he didn't plan it. I'm just calling it. Yeah. Like, okay. <laughs> um, what do you do when you feel stuck? Right? Well, when I feel stuck, I just go and shake it off. Yes. I, you release I the tensions. release right? the tensions. I just disconnect from everything. And I connect with nature. I do something else that is not um, like uh, with the electronics or like... I just... I just stop doing... Yes. Stop to do what... I'm doing like what I'm doing. What That's I'm good. Doing. Yeah. So you can go within and you can see yeah. like why am I feeling like this? Why am I frustrated? Right? Why am I angry? Why am I in fear? Like what's happening, right? And that's the only way, because many times what do people do? What do we also do it sometimes, right? It's like we try to like, oh fake that nothing's happening. Oh no, 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 it's okay, let's look somewhere else. But no, no, it is happening. I am anxious, I am angry, I am frustrated. There's there's an yeah. emotion that doesn't feel good, right? Yeah. So if you don't if you don't if you don't if you don't move it, if you don't transform it, it's gonna stay there, it's gonna come out at some point, right? And it's gonna affect you. So, so that's it. He's very right. All right, man. Thank yeah, you very no much. Leave. Thank you so much. Woohoo! Thank you, Danny. There you go. 14 years old, guys. He wrote his book already. He's rocking it. He's so committed to his work. You can follow him. him. In, uh, in, in the Facebook and in Instagram if you want. He's amazing, he's really nice. To, to, he's motivating teenagers to wake up and he's like, come on guys, get out of your video games. Like, come, read books, do trainings, come work from within. You can transform anything that's holding you back. It's really cool to see. And that's what we're doing today, guys. We are going deep within ourselves. So yesterday we got raw and real, right? We're like, okay, let me ground. How am I really feeling right now in life in general, right? Like, am I feeling good like with my partner? Am I feeling good with like myself, with my purpose, with my business? Like wh what I'm doing in life? Like, do we come to this beautiful world, this beautiful planet, right? Do we come to just survive, guys? Just to make the money, just to barely make it, just to just for material things? Or are we here committed to 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 taste that Amrita we call? In, in Tantra, we call in different, in different philosophies of yoga. So the Amrita is like, it's the elixir of life. We all have that available. It's inside of us. It's what we call the DMT that you can get from like medicine, right? Plant medicine. But it's all inside of us. That's all I teach. How to awaken the DMT inside of you. 
how to awaken the ananda mind that we talked about yesterday, which is the bliss hormone. How amazing is that, guys? We are our own cultivators of the bliss hormone. We can do it ourselves. We don't need anything or anyone. I mean, it's great when you're making love and that those hormones wake up and it's like the love hormone, right? It's like, oh my God, oxytocin, like going off or dopamine and like, my God, life is so good. But guys, can we do it from ourselves, right? From within, that's the alchemy, guys. And that's what we do with quantum flow, which is this method right here that, that I'm, 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 I'm sharing with you guys. The quantum flow method is all about, okay, let me ground into myself. How is my life right now? Every area of my life, where do I want to focus? Okay, I want to focus on my energy. I want to amplify my energy. I want to open up to my purpose. I want to open up to a new business or to new ideas or something. Um, it's called quantum flow. Quantum flow method, guys. That's what I teach. I've been teaching it for years. You can look at all my videos, all my stuff. Yeah, so um, uh, I do a lot of free stuff on that. I'm doing a quantum flow training right now. We have 70 people learning the method, ready to share it with the whole world. We're just beginning in the training. So if you're called to do this also, you're welcome to join in. Uh, it's a very powerful method because what happens is that you get to help people, to help ourselves, right, to release the memories from the past. All the memories, since you were in the womb of the mother, are in your body, right? Are in your brain, are in your nervous system. We can't run away from them. No matter what you do, they're always going to be there unless you work on them. And there's many people that use like NLP and they use mindset and they use hypnosis and all this is amazing. I, I've, I've studied myself and I, I use it in quantum flow, but I found also that there's a missing link out there that creates even more impact, opens even more uh, ourselves into our full potential because it incorporates the body, the nervous system, like physically, using breath work, using meditation, using movement, we get into the nervous system, right? And we release the memories from the nervous system, the patterns that have been set there for so long, for so long, guys, who knows from where. That's why it's so hard to change them through your mind. You gotta do the work through your body. And it's not also something that, of course, you're gonna see the results very fast. All my clients, all my students, everybody that teaches quantum flow, they see results just like that. Guys, it's manifestation at its maximum potential, especially when you really learn the science and the art of manifestation, right? Because it's a science and an art. You mix both, right? That's the fun of it, right? So when you really get that and you start embodying it, you start seeing results just like that. But why? Because at a material level in your body, you start waking up that energy which is stuck in the base of your spine and all of a sudden that energy is going up through the spine which we call the inductance field in quantum physics or we call the shushumna nadi in Ayurveda, in yoga, in Tantra. It's the same, it's, it's that field of energy in the center of your spine related to your spine. The thing is here, we're working it from a nervous system point of view. It's not just like, oh yeah, the energy, the chakras, the vortexes. No, I'm all about science. I'm a science geek, guys. So when you study quantum physics and you know the chemistry of the body and you know that there are like little crystals that are stuck right there in the base of your spine, in your organs, in your core, they're literally there. This is quantum mechanics, guys. There's biophotons right now vibrating in every cell of our being. That's how the cells communicate. It's the same, it's the same energy that comes from the sun. It's biophotonic energy. But if you have stuck energy in your body, you won't be receiving all the universal energy that's available to you right now. And this is related to the energy you feel every day, how you wake up in the morning. This is related how you focus your mind and how, how connected are you to your purpose, how connected are you to your drive, to your inspiration. It's related to how loving you are. How are you in your relationships? It's related to what are you attracting? Just look around you right, right now, guys. Look around you in your life and know that everything that you have right now is just a result of your life and what you have said yes to and what you have said no to. Yes, guys, it's just a result of every decision you've made till now. 
So it's time to stop blaming other people and start owning our own responsibility and saying, yes, I've done amazing here. This is incredible. And oh my God, really, I've always attracted the same relationships, right? It's always the same drama. Like the, the partners change, but, but it's like the faces change, but the drama is the same, right? Have you experienced that? Let me know. I've, I've experienced that many times. Many times until I committed to see myself and say, why am I attracting the same relationships? Why am I attracting the same people that come and hurt me or do these kind of things to me or betray me or do this? What do I have in my field, in my energetic field that is attracting that? You know what I mean? And the same is with the positive, all the abundance, all the prosperity, the health, the beauty, everything. Everything that you can awaken up in yourself and attract in your life is just a result of your inner alchemy. How capable are you to transform anything that's in your field, guys? Hmm? Anything that's not aligned to your highest self. That you see me. I'm a warrior. Strong warrior, but at the same time, I'm fun and I'm like a little kid. You know, you see that balance in me all the time because that's how I've cultivated the energy. I don't want to get too serious. But I know when I've got to do the work and I see my addiction patterns coming through and I see my self-sabotage coming through and I see my procrastination coming through. Give me a yes if you get me. Give me a yes if you understand me, right? Who, who doesn't have that here and there, right? We want to do something. We say, I'm going to go in diet. I'm going to work out every day. I'm going to read the book. I'm going to do the training. I'm going to start sharing online. Whatever. Why don't we do it? Why don't we do it? Because there are patterns that we haven't worked on at a cellular level, at, at a memory level, that keep us bringing us down in the same way, right? So the moment you shift it, the patterns go away. All of a sudden, guys, I don't crave the, the gallon of chocolate ice cream that I used to eat. 20 years ago, I had huge sugar cravings. I was those that I would go and hide in the kitchen or somewhere in my closet <laughs> and eat a gallon. Guys, I'm not kidding, a gallon of ice cream. That's how I was so like anxious inside and so many emotions, I didn't know what, how to deal with them, you know? But instead of like working with them, I would stuff them down with sugar, right? Or you can use alcohol, you can use sex, you can use pornography, you can use whatever you, you want. There's nothing wrong, I'm not playing to be an angel, but where are you doing it from? Where are you taking that substance from? Where are you eating the sugar? Where are you taking the alcohol? Where are you coming from? Because if you're coming from a place of numbing yourself, I mean, you can keep playing the game, but sooner or later, it's all going to be revealed, right? <laughs> the truth is always going to be revealed sooner or later, right? So, yeah, guys, when we do the work and we get raw and real and we say, you know what? I'm done with these distracting patterns. I'm done with this self-sabotage. I'm done with this procrastination. I want to do the work. Right? So this is what we're doing right now. I'm gonna go, I could continue for hours. If you want more information on quantum flow and what happens in the body and what we do, just send me a message. I can, I can, I can talk for hours about this, but I know many of you here are here to do the work physically too, right? I promised it and I'm here to deliver it, right? Just know that I get very passionate about these things. It's my thing, like my whole body buzzes. So who's ready? Who's committed to do quantum flow right now? Get into your body and start shifting whatever needs to be shifting. I, I want to hear uh, a yes. I need a yes from you guys right now. Even if you're watching the replay right now, guys, give me a yes. Tell me you just jumped in. Let me know what's your name, where you're from, and give me a yes. Yeah, I'm going to give you all I've got, but I want to feel you with me too. Yes, I see you. I see you. Uh, YouTube, I see you, Facebook, yes, many yeses, so ready for the work. And I know you do a lot of work, guys. I know I have amazing masters, teachers, Qigong practitioners, yoga teachers, meditators. I know I've got all kinds of friends in my community. You're all amazing. I see you. I honor you. I love you. Yes, I see you, Instagram too. Yes, give me a yes. Give me a heart. That, that's bringing the energy together, guys. We're bringing it. Bring it higher. Bring it higher. Bring it higher. Yes, yes. Yes. <laughs> and if you can share this right now, guys, because now we're going to go into the deep work. If you can press the share button right now, 
in your in your live stream just go to where it says share and press it down you're gonna be sharing it in your own Facebook or in your own Instagram or wherever and we're gonna bring more people in and we're gonna help them with this practice that can help many people right now because you know many people are having a tough time you know it's tough times for many people so if we can share this and yes commit to it and go as deep as we can I think we're gonna have a great time and we're gonna connect with a deeper vortex I keep I keep seeing yes I keep seeing yes I see many many quantum flowers I see you brothers sisters I see you many quantum flow teachers here showing up I see you guys amazing thank you thank you thank you yes we are changing the world guys together thank you all for being here thank you all guys all right now with gratitude that is the first principle of quantum flow. We always start with gratitude, guys. Why? Why gratitude? Because sometimes we are focusing on the black dot on the white piece of paper. We're focusing on what's missing in our lives. When can I come out of the house? When can I see my friends? When can I, right? We get lost in the outside world instead of focusing on like, oh, what gift does this have for me right now, right? And when we start doing that, ah. Oh, our field starts opening up. Gratitude is the highest vibration. It's all vibration in life, right? There's low vibration, which is anger, frustration, sadness, all that. Nothing bad, but it's just a low vibration. You can feel it, it's sluggish. Gratitude is the highest vibration. So when we connect with gratitude, just with the breath, just by being present, oh, thank you, thank you. Do it with me. Just be grateful just for being you, for being alive, for being present right now, for this live stream we're doing together. Just take your time to breathe. Ah, thank you, thank you, thank you. And just feel the relief that happens in your body. You can sense it, you can feel it. Just know that it's happening. Any sense of stress, of doubt, of fear, let it go with the exhalation. In the inhalation, let, let it expand inside of you. It's like expanding that love, expanding that light, expanding that power of who you are. Oh, and then releasing, releasing, releasing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I am available. Thank you. I am present. I am here now. Thank you. I thank my guides, my spiritual guides, my energetic guides. They're always there for me. You can call them angels, you can call them light beings, you can call them just ener energy beings. Just know that you are protected, guys. Know this. Even if your rational mind doesn't believe it, don't listen to your rational mind sometimes. Start connecting with your soul, with your soul, with your heart. You know, you feel them, you sense them, you know they're there for you always. So we open up to that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I open, I am receptive. Deep breath. Exhale, expand your arms. <sighs> open up, stretch, stretch up. Open up, tuck in your tailbone, tuck in your, uh, your, your, your navel, and open up, find a nice stretch. You know, we all can stretch, grab your elbows. Uh, we're still sitting down, hey? This is very simple. And open to one side. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Center, inhale, open to the other side. Beautiful, come back to center. Relax your jaw, move your head from side to side. Beautiful, feeling good. Inhale your arms up. Hold it, bring it through your mouth. Expand it, even my fingers are like laser beams all the way up, expand it, expand it, expand it, and then exhale. The sound really works. The sound really helps to relax your whole nervous system. Goes into your vagus nerve and just relaxes your parasympathetic nervous system. Gets to be activated actually and starts sending these signals of, oh, it's all good. I'm safe. I'm open. I'm receptive. Thank you. Take another deep breath all the way up. Hold it. Inner smile. Remember, thank you, thank you, thank you. Zip it in. Expand it, open up to the heavens, open up. Connect with the sun, yes, I am the sun, yes, I embody the sun, thank you. All the energy from the sun, bring it in. Oh, just receive it, 
Just receive it. Even if you don't feel it, don't worry. It's happening, guys. Beautiful. In however way you want, connect with the earth. Just energetically close your eyes. Bring your hands to your heart or just relax them to the sides. And Mother Earth, Pachamama, yes, living being that is the planet Earth and it's emanating energy that we can measure scientifically. Thank you, I receive you, Mother. I receive you. Pachamama, gracias, Mama, gracias. Thank you for all the love. Thank you for all the food. Thank you for your presence. Thank you, we're so happy you are resting right now. You're breathing again. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Mother. May you recover you recover and shine even more. Thank you so much. We love you. Inhale this energy with no rationality, just with your intention. Inhale it into your heart. Expand your chest. Hold it. Zip it in. Hold it. Relax your, your jaw. Relax your neck. Inner smile. And exhale with the sound. Ah. Let your whole body melt, 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 melt. Now use your arms. Inhale. Bring it up. Hold it. Hold it. Activate it. Ground into your body. Remember yesterday, the grounding activates your muscles, but relax your jaw. Always relaxed. You're floating like a balloon. Exhale. Oh. Down to the earth. Thank you, Mother. Thank you, thank you, thank you. One more. Inhale it all the way up. Hold it. Zip it in. Activate your muscles. Come on, warriors. We've got this. But relax. Remember, relax. It's not hard on your system. Relax. We'll go really hard after. Right now, be soft and gentle. Exhale. Beautiful. Just observe what happens in your body just with these simple breaths, these simple activations. Now focus your attention in the center of your chest, your heart, your energetic heart. Breathe into that zone. Feel that zone physically first. Focus your attention right there. Focus your attention all around you. Feel how from the center of your chest, your heart, everything emanates. The energy emanates all around you. It's our energetic field. It's always there. We can measure it. We can take photographs of it. It's something scientific. No woo-woo thing here. It is what it is. So just know that it's there and it's expanding with your intention. When we're in our heart, that's where we plant our seed. Why are you here, guys? What's your intention? You don't have to write it down. Don't worry. Feel it inside of you. Close your eyes. Feel it inside of you. What's your intention? What are you calling into your life? So I love using the intention I am. It can be I am health. I am energy. I am love. I am peace. Hold on to one. The one you want to invoke the most right now in your life. I am. And just let yourself feel grateful for you're invoking that right now. You're bringing your future to the now. You're saying to the quantum field, it is already done. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, I surrender to this process of manifestation. I am open and receptive for the alchemy of anything that is holding me down to activate my full potential. Beautiful, guys. And so it is. So together, after we ground it, let's go into alchemy. Take a deep breath. Exhale with the sound. Relax your head. Yeah, look at me. Relax. Inhale. Exhale. Let your whole neck, your spine relax. Inhale. Exhale. Start getting that movement in your spine. You've got this, guys. Trust me. It's going to change your life. 
Go for it. Find that bliss in your movement. And even if it's uncomfortable, go for it. It's not about living in bliss all the time. You know, sometimes we're going through uncomfortable situations. And that's okay. Feel them. Purge them. Release them. This is your time. Any fear, any doubt, guys. So here, we're going all the way down, vertebrae by vertebrae, up, exhaling down through your mouth, inhaling through your nose. Keep going, guys. Keep going, guys. I'm gonna bring the drum, keep going. Keep going, guys, keep going, keep going. I'm gonna play some music for you. Get that sound going. as you can, hold it, stretch it up, zip it in, expand yourself, expand your body, every joint in your body, exhale, release, oh, receive, let that inner smile just blossom, it's all welcome, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, I am open and receptive to this, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, bring your hands to your heart. Tap it in. Make it up. One more. Always the energy goes to the heart, guys. Always. Inhale. Hold it, zip it in. Expand it. You've got this. Expand it more. Relax your jaw. Remember, let the energy flow all the way up into your brain. Expand it. Grow, grow, grow. And receive. Oh. <laughs> Just receive. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Connect with your intention. I am recording every cell of your being. You're already Bringing that into your field. I am, I am, I am. I am love. I am light. I am energy. I am abundance. I am health. Whatever you want to call right now, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah. Ah. Beautiful, beautiful, guys. <laughs> So good, guys. Give me a yes if you're with me. <laughs> Give me a yes if that was good. That was just a little taste. A little first alchemy, guys. First alchemy session. How was that? Let me know. How are you feeling? 
Let me know if you're grounded, if you're feeling good, if the energy is flowing through you. <laughs> yes, I love it. Yes, good. Yes, feels amazing. Yes, let me know. Write down. Ah, oh, thank you. I'm grateful for you. Yes, I love it. Yes, amazing. Yes, feeling light, feeling excellent, feeling good. I'm reading all the comments right here, guys. Instagram, Facebook, all of them. Yes, yes. Whoop, boom, 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 boom. What a high. Loved it. Yes, it's a real high, guys. No, we don't need anything from outside. It's all inside of us. Ah, oh, yes, yes. Okay, many hearts there, many hearts. Yes, many loves, many comments. I love it, guys. Good, good, guys. We're on this. You know, you've got to release this. Why does this work? Because you're moving your spine and you're breathing at the same time. It's like, a, like an energetic vomit, you know? And the more you can do it, you can practice this anytime to release any emotion that's not working in your field. Release it. Okay, it helps so much to open space. We need to, instead of being constricted, instead of being contracted, we want to be expanded. We want to be open. We want to be alive and awake. Who's feeling alive and awake? <laughs> I love this. I love this. All right, guys. Yes, activates the spine. Of course, it moves the energy in the spine, which the spine at the nervous system is related to all the energy system around you. So the spine is very important. All right? Okay, guys, so here we go. We're gonna go deeper. Who's ready to go deeper? Who's ready to go deeper, guys? Because now I'm gonna show you um, a solar plexus release, okay? And this is not only related to your solar plexus, which is your warrior, your inspiration, your purpose, like your driving life. Who wants more drive, right? Not only sexual drive, but life drive. Right? They're all they're both they're both aligned, right? They're both together. But but how can we bring that sexual energy to our life and feel good and love life and love ourselves and love the world no matter what happens outside of us? Being that love energy, right? That's the next level of love. It's unconditional love. And when you love yourself and you love your life, everything around you just expands. And you're just calling the best people, the best relationships, the best energy around you because it's magnetism, right? So falling in love, rising in love with life. Now, this is really going to help us because what happens, just, just to go a little bit on the theory, what happens, there's a little knot here. It's an energetic knot, but it's physical too. It's right in the solar plexus. So many times we get stuck in that knot and the accumulation of emotions don't let the energy go up into the heart. That's the abundance. That's prosperity. That's radiancy. That's charisma. That's love. So if we don't release the emotions that get stuck here, because as we said in the last video um, that you, ha you haven't seen it, please go see the replay, video number one. Uh, we talked about how emotions are energy emotions and they get stuck in your body. So the moment you start moving them and releasing them, it's like your channel just opens up. The energy opens up. Your spine and all the chemistry in the spine, it gets electrified. And that's what you want. You want to electrify. You want to charge up the ions in your spine for the ions to start floating up. And it's almost like liquid golden light that starts entering from the back of your head here up into your frontal lobe that this is your lobe of manifestation. This is your lobe of creation. This is your lobe of creativity, right? So that's what you want to do, opening that pathway that comes from the core. So many times in that pathway, the energy gets stuck in the solar plexus, guys. So I'm going to show you here, just so you know. You can do it sitting down, okay? So you got to find your navel and your sternum, okay? And then between the navel and the sternum, with your fingers, you're going to stop, you're going to start like massaging that a little bit, just, just to feel it out, guys. Take your time. Don't kill yourself yet, okay? Well, you're not going to kill yourself, never, but you know it can hurt a lot. And it's, it's, I call it, this is Chinese medicine. It's not, it's not Chinese torture. <laughs> it's really Chinese medicine. This is one of the basic... Um, exercise that you in Chinet San, which is all the science, 5,000 ancestral practice, 
of the science of how to move energy in your internal organs and how they're related to emotions and how they're related to everything in life. So it's really deep stuff, but this is one of the most powerful ones. And of course, I, I use it. I, I use the basics of it because everything in quantum flow has the basics of the ancestral techniques, but then we take it to the next level because many times the ancestral techniques get caught up in, in you know, ancestral teachings of 5,000 years ago that have upgraded. Now, kind of the nervous system is different. The ego is different. Um, all the conditions, society is different. The pandemics are different. Everything's different. So, of course, we've got to upgrade it and, 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 and open up to the new, but always respecting that universal principles the ancestral principles. It's so important, right? So I don't know if you're feeling it. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. So now to feel it a little more, you take a, a deep breath. If you haven't found your, the pain, search for it. There must be a point where oh, it's a little stuck. Exhale. Oh, come forward just like this. Relax your head. You don't want tension in your head. Remember, never tension in your neck or your jaw. Inhale up. And you exhale forward like this. So it's not pushing. Your abdominals are not hard. You're super soft because you want to go inside. You want to be that scientist. And at the same time, the experiment, right? We are the scientist and the experiment that's happening. We are the object and the subject at the same time. Inhale. Exhale through your mouth like this. This relieves so much tension, guys, that we have stuck. Oh. I did it yesterday. I'm not feeling it again today. I've been just working with so many people, guys. I've been nonstop. I've never done so much work in my life, I think. These, these days have been like so intense. So many clients and working with so many people, you know? So many times, yeah, we accumulate and, and we gotta, it got, it's, it's got to flow because it's gonna affect you, right? So it's very important to release it. Oh. Release, keep going guys, it can be uncomfortable, keep going. Oh. And visualize like it's like a black vomit coming out of your mouth. You don't want that negative energy inside of you, bring it out of your body. Release, release, one more. Beautiful, inhale, hold it, we created space, now hold it, big Buddha belly, expand it, big Buddha belly, exhale, oh. inhale, now arms up, expand it, expand it, open space, open space, let that Space that you created in your body, be filled with new, fresh energy. <sighs> Remember your intention. Receive. <sighs> it's like a golden light shower coming through yourself, through you. You can feel it, you can sense it, or just know that it's happening. Every time you open your channel, every time you release, new energy is coming through. Energy is transformed. One more. Inhale all the way up. <sighs> Hold it, open your eyes, zip it in, open it up, yes, say yes to life, yes, I'm open, I'm receptive, thank you, and then we see, let your body move, good guys, good, so let's go deeper now, yeah, here, we're going to stand up one more, now I want to open more here because we released a lot, right, so inhale forward, and exhale, open your arms, yeah? You wanna open throat, chest, and solar plexus. Yeah, you wanna open everything, careful with your neck. I'm not, I'm not pushing back, careful with your neck. It's not about the neck, it's very soft and gentle, guys. Please, I can't see you right now, so please take care of yourselves, okay? So inhale forward. Open it up, come on guys, you've got this. Remember, you're releasing energy, right? You're transforming the energy that once was stuck. Now it's opening up. 
Okay, keep going guys, you've got this. Forward and back. The sound is very important. Remember you're working on your vagus nerve that's at the back related to your reptilian brain. You wanna release the energy accumulated because it's energy of survival. We're not surviving, we're thriving guys. Come on, keep going. Open it up. Alchemy. Transform. Transmute. Open it up. Do it like a celebration, guys. You've got this. Do it like a celebration. Come on. Deep breath, hold it again, stretch it up, open space in your body. Yes, I'm flexible, I'm open, I'm receptive. And receive that golden shower coming through. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I am blessed that inner freedom is blossoming in every cell of my being. I don't need anything or anyone to feel alive and awake, to feel freedom, to feel power. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, just love yourself, guys. Be grateful for you, for who you are, for all the work you've done, for everything you've released, for all the gifts, for all the challenges that turn into opportunities. Thank you, I'm grateful for everything. I trust the universe that everything happens for a reason. And I use all these challenges into opportunities. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Ah. To your heart, expand it, ground it into your body. Oh, I love my body, I love feeling alive and awake. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> All right, guys, <laughs> yeah, good, huh? Good, are you feeling present? Are you feeling alive? Are you feeling good with yourself, right? It's like. <sighs> Full opening connection, huh? Yeah, everything good. We're gonna we're gonna stand up. I'm gonna take you deeper, guys. I, I want to go deeper with you. Share another alchemy one for you. Yeah. Let me know if you want or if you have enough. Let me know if that was too much or you want a yes. You want to go deeper. <laughs> also, let me know if you have any question or anything you want to share with me, please. Please let me know if you loved it or you're like, oh my god, that's too woo woo for me. I don't know what to do. It's too much energy. <laughs> That could happen and it's also okay, you know, especially first times working with energy. I've had even yoga people come through, Qigong people that work with amounts of energy, very deep. When they do quantum flow, they're like, whoa! Like it, it, it works with the chakras, with the vortexes of energy in a spiral way. 
So I can't explain that right now because it's, it's kind of very scientific, very quantum physics. But what's happening is that we're biohacking the nervous system and we're entering the chakras, not only like this, yeah, the vortexes of energy in the solar and the nervous plexus, not only like this, but we're working in spirals, creating different figures that just wake you up and give you this energy that's like, whoa. <laughs> Oh, let me know if you love me. Why am I crying? You're crying because it opens up also emotions that are stuck. It's okay, lady. Why do I get dizzy? Because we're doing deep energetic work. And when you're holding the breath and you're releasing the nervous system that's been so attached in certain patterns, it's normal to feel dizzy too. It's normal that emotions come up. Guys, just so you know, this is not a bliss woo-woo thing that I'm sharing with you, like unicorns and angels. I mean, yeah, you could see them sometimes and there's colors and there's all these kinds of experiences you can have. But sometimes this process, it's, it's, kind, of, it's kind of uncomfortable because you're moving old stuff. But guys, if you're not committed to moving old stuff, then what? You're going to be living the same life forever, right? So love yourself if you're crying, if you're like not feeling... Ah, oh, the best right now if you're not feeling blissful. It's all good, guys. It's all good. Welcome it. Love yourself no matter what. Remember that. Love yourself no matter what. Not only in the good times when you're blissed out, but also when you're crying, when you're sensitive, when you're vulnerable. Love yourself. Only you can give yourself that love, not anyone else. And when you love yourself, all of a sudden, everyone comes to love you. Everyone just wants to love you because you have the love channel open, right? Yes, yes, yes. Oh my God, reminds me of our training in Costa Rica. Yes, Adriana, of course. Um, oh, then you have no room for new. Exactly, if you don't release from the old, thank you, Laura, you don't have room for the new, right? You gotta, you gotta empty your cup. And that sometimes hurts because we're so used to repeating the same thing in the same way right the same thought the same emotions but what happens that gives you the same results so if you want to have different results in your life if you want to upgrade your relationship upgrade your business upgrade your health your body your strength your mindset your emotions your passion your purpose you gotta let go of the past it's impossible if we don't let go of the past to start bringing the future self the highest self the greatest version of you to the now. Yeah? Whew. All right, girls. Guys, girls, you ready to rock? Ready for more? Good, good. I just wanna address the people that are going through stuff and know that that's normal too, all right? We're not doing this for just bliss. The bliss will come, I promise you, right? Let that emotion, if the emotions come through, let it flow. I promise you at some point the bliss will come. And it could be after the practice. It could be when you go lie down. It could be tonight. It could be tomorrow morning you wake up blissed out. Doesn't matter. No attachment to the practice. But quantum flow works on this way. You do the work and then after all of a sudden, boom, you're like, oh my God, what's all this energy? <laughs> I just feel so good. I just love life. You know, and maybe not in one session. You need to do more sessions, right? But that's why we're doing a five-day activation. And of course, if you want to go deeper, there's so much that we can do, guys. I, 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 I'm sharing these practices all over the world and doing a lot of online stuff. So, so there's more. Go step by step, all right? So, yes, so much love. Get ready to rock. Let's stand up, please. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. Okay, move the chair a little bit. I love making the, 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 the practice fun because I feel sometimes, you know, I did yoga for 25 years and I was one of them like, all perfect, the alignment, it's all perfection, you know, it's like, like a robot because it has to be with a ruler, you know, I was one of them, you know, Iyengar, Ashtanga, all that stuff, many years doing that and it's amazing, it gave me so much but then I'm like, you know what? be in flow i want to have fun in my practice i want to i want to move i want to dance i want to be me i don't want to be just namaste everyone okay welcome to my yoga class today now let's put a yoga class masks and everybody is perfect everybody follow me on perfection okay <laughs> whatever I, i'm not making 
fan of, of, of you know, of yoga. It's, it's more like the personalities that we get into and I used to do that too. So I see myself and, you know, I put it out there. Maybe somebody's touched by that. Somebody can change. We don't have to change personalities. Spirituality is your lifestyle. It's how you live. You don't just light up a candle and become spiritual. You don't just go to the church and become spiritual. Spirituality is now, is how you breathe. Is how you, how you, how you look. Is how you move. Is how you talk to people. Is how you look them in the eyes. Is how you say thank you. Is how you laugh. Is how you are real with yourself and express your truth. Is how you move in life. Is how you share your gifts to the world. Guys, it's everything. There's no separation between spirituality and the world. Like, we're uniting them, guys. We're demystifying spirituality. We're living it. We're walking the talk. It's not about being spiritual. Everyone is spiritual. What do you mean? Because you meditate five hours, you think you're more spiritual than somebody else? Come on, guys. Because you do three hours of yoga a day? Who cares? You're not more spiritual than anybody else. We're all spiritual. Some people don't realize how spiritual they are. They don't realize it, you know? So they're like, oh, okay. Okay, let, let, let me try to be spiritual somehow. But we, our soul is there already. All we're doing is getting off the way for our soul to reveal itself. There's nothing woo-woo here. It's just the bliss of being alive and awake. It's simple. <laughs> All right, guys, let's have some fun here. Okay, so standing up. Move a little bit, shake it off, shake it off. Find that movement, right? Shake it off. I love the shaking. Danny, my son, was talking about it. It's one of the, the alchemy movements that we do in quantum flow too. So um, just shake it off a little bit, right? Da -da 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 -da. How good it feels to shake it off. Ah, get some sound in there. Yeah, look at my hands, get some elbows, get some shoulders. Ah. How good does it feel, guys? Just shake it off. You know, animals do this all the time, right? When, when animals are scared, they have fear, they're running away from another animal. After they're, they're, they're done, they're like... <laughs> they shake it off, right? It's a natural thing. We forgot this instinct that we all have. I don't know why. Because they teach us that's not good, that doesn't look good. What are they going to say? Blah, blah, blah. But... Just fix this. Ah, there you go. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm just working with three phones here. I'm with all of you, just so you know. Keep shaking it off, guys. Keep shaking it off. Don't accumulate any tensions. Why do you accumulate any tensions there? Right? Okay, now. Nah. <sighs> I'm free, I'm free, I'm free. Yes, I am free to move. I am free to express myself. I am free of energy flowing through my joints. You want to release your joints. Your joints are, are vortexes of energy in your body. You got to release them. Yeah, you got to move them. <sighs> okay, now, ready? Come back to center. Keep that shaking soft and gentle, just like that. Look at me. It's like a gentle shaking. You're grounding the shaking into your body. Bend your knees and feel just gentle. Relax your jaw. Remember, no tension in your jaw. That's it, guys. That's it. Just grounding the energy into your bones. You want to go into your bones, your muscles, of course, but go all the way into your bones. Beautiful. Keep breathing. You've got this. You've got this. You've got this. Now, inhale. Hold it. Bend your knees just a little bit, tuck in your tailbone just a little bit, just to ground that energy all the way down into the earth. Muscles active. And exhale. Release, 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 release. Relax your neck. Inhale all the way up. Activate your muscles. Relax. Activating the muscles doesn't mean you're straining your jaw. You want the energy to flow into your neck, into your head. All the way down. Inhale. Hold it. And release. Inhale, hold it, muscles, and release. Find your own flow. Don't try to be Juanpa, don't try to be anyone else. Be you. What's your version? 
Die Nüsse machen. Mm. Yum, 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 yum. Eh, like, oh. Now we go deeper, guys. Now we're gonna shake it. When we exhale, look at me first. Look at me first. Exhale like this. <sighs> yeah? Look at my shoulders. I completely release tension. Careful with your neck. So I'm gonna do this. And now all the tensions in my neck and my shoulders. <sighs> with the sound. Even my, my mouth does like. <clears throat> Everything releases, right? So you inhale, bend your knees, let it go, shake it off. Maybe it's very subtle, guys, keep going. Maybe it's very subtle, maybe you're very sensitive. If I'm a little harsh or I'm a little, you know, like too much, you, you're not me, find your own flow. That's what quantum flow is about. What is your flow? Not the teacher's flow, what is your flow? Can you find the movement that works for you? Yeah? Three more. One more. This last one, stay. Hold it, activate. Activate, relax your jaw. Exhale, bend your knees. Bend your knees, activate your legs, right? Inhale all the way up. Hold it. And exhale, release. Beautiful. One more. Inhale up, stretch it up. Hold it. And exhale, release. <sighs> That's it, guys. Good, good. Let's release the tensions here, guys. Open up, back. So inhale. Hold it. Relax your neck. Release. One more, you want a nice stretch. You want to release the tensions in your shoulders. Nice. Nice, guys. Okay, last shaking, okay? I want you to release any tension that's in your body right now. So first, activate your muscles. Feel the connection. The activation of your muscles, guys. Feel that. I want you to feel that, but have your neck and your and your and your and your jaw is relaxed, right? Feel the connection with your muscles right there. Yeah? Good. Keep it. Keep it. Keep it. Inhale. And now shake it off. <sighs> shake it off, guys. Go for it. Go for it. I'll play some music for you. Thank you, thank you, exhale. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Inhale all the way up your arms. Let your body move. If your breath is going super fast, it's all okay. Just feel yourself, love yourself wherever you're at right now. One more breath, inhale. And bring it down <sighs> into your heart. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Again, connect with your intention. Ah, so much love, so much light. I am free. I don't depend on anything or anyone from outside to feel this freedom. Thank you. 
come back to my power. Yes. And so it is. Ah, beautiful guys. Woo! Okay, let me sit down here. An hour of activation. How good was that, guys? How are you guys feeling? Hmm? <laughs> come back to your body. Come back to your breath. So good to share this space with you guys. Let me know how you're going, how you're feeling. Let me know uh, that you're good. <laughs> Did you like the shaking? Did you like the alchemy? Free, amazing. Yes, I love it. That was wonderful. Thank you. Yes, incredible. Oh my God. Feeling buzzing my whole body. Oh my God, so many emotions. Yes, that's good, guys. Emotions, energy feels amazing awesome i feel great amazing yes awesome bro perfect yes man yes feeling good wow that was amazing great guys it's about having fun right your spiritual practice can be fun we don't have to get so serious guys let's celebrate life more <laughs> life is good even though if like in challenging situations we can find the bliss my computer got heated up and activated. <laughs> oh, I so love it. I feel so alive and tingly. Uh, I love alchemy. I love the shaking. I loved all of it. I feel alive. The shaking is so therapeutic. Yes. I love the alchemy, especially the shaking. You're amazing. Feels good. Oh, thank you, guys. You guys are amazing, too. I love you guys so much. You're, you're such a beautiful community. I'm so, so grateful to share this space with you guys. So much love for every one of you. So much love for the change we're doing together. Thank you for committing, guys. Thank you for saying yes today to this practice. I know we have a thousand distractions, but you said yes. You stayed with it. You stayed with it till the end. I see the same people showing up. Same people stayed with it. Thank you so much, guys. You guys are incredible. I love it. And um, yeah, please share this with your community. Tag someone that you feel can benefit from this. Imagine anyone doing this shaking and releasing, like people that you see tense or people that you know are having a hard time right now. Share this practice. That's what this is for, guys. Yeah. And you can go over it again. If you feel later and you're like, oh my God, I need to release. Go, go. Just go into the Facebook Live and go over it. Just tell me, Juanpa, I'm doing it again. It feels so good. <laughs> Oh my God, I love quantum health. So many people in my courses here. Thank you so much. I'm so happy that, that um, yeah, quantum flow is being shared with the world in so many ways. And there's so many gifts that we are all receiving from it, this practice. So very, very grateful. Let's, 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 um, let's share this vibration now with the whole world, guys. Like everything we do for us, we're doing for our families. And we're doing for all the world, right? So, so energetically, let's do this. If you if you want to join me, it, it, it's amazing because the, when we do it together, we have all the countries of the world here almost together right now, right? So imagine from all the countries we're uniting in this web and sending love to all humanity, telling humanity with our love, with our presence, that it's all okay that it's all perfect, that it's all divinely aligned. It all happens for a reason all the time. Trust the universe. Trust what makes your heart beat. Try, trust what makes the, 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 the earth rotate and, 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 and move and, and, the, and the sun shine and the wind blow and the earth and the waves crash. Trust that energy is inside of you, okay? So let's breathe into our hearts, hands together into our hearts. Breathing love, light, energy. Hold it, breathe it in, and expand it with the sound. Beautiful. Inhale into your heart, connect with your family right now, all your family. Not only the family that you have around you, but even your ancestors, and the children in your family, everyone is like the family tree. And let's, let, let's send love to our family tree. If you want to open your arms with the sound, that helps expand the energy all around you too. Deep breath. Uh... And 
last A, ah, which is the sound of the heart, the sound of love, we send it to all humanity. From wherever you're at, send it to all your country. Visualize your country full of light. Visualize the world full of light, full of light, pure light, pure love. Together, inhale. Just relax your arms. Just be present wherever you're at right now. Thank you all so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you for being a light in this darkness. Thank you for being a mountain for the people that are going through hard times. Thank you for being a leader in this world where our leaders are like burning down and we don't know who to look at anymore, right? So we wake up our inner leader. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you all. So much love. So <laughs> we'll see you around, guys, tomorrow, same time, 11 a.m. Please tell your people, bring more people in. Let's make this a huge revolution evolution right it's a spiritual revolution we're doing together guys and getting people in their bodies getting people connecting to the truth to the truth what we can control right so thank you so much leave your comment there if you haven't left it whatever you want to share right now from the practice whoever you want to tag and um we'll see you tomorrow for sure guys keep rocking it so much love to all of you guys. So blissful. Like you made my day. I'm like, oh, now I gotta go work with clients. But I'm just like, oh my God, I'm just pure bliss right now. <laughs> oh God. Oh my God. If you have any questions, um, please mes uh, message me. I'm seeing T Sam saying she feels some pressure at the base of her throat. Any questions that you have, please just private message me, yeah? The base of the throat, I would open up more. This is the, the throat chakra, is the purification chakra, right? So here, um, something to release it. <sighs> open it up because it's truth you haven't shared. It's energy that's still stuck there. Many times we don't speak our truth. It's time to speak our truth, guys. So... <sighs> Release everything around your throat, okay? If you feel that tension and the energy is gonna flow. Do more shaking. Shake it off, move it, okay? And any other question, just send me a, a message and I'll answer you, okay, guys? Mucho amor. Pura vida. Boom.